So, we are back in the world of Dungeon Siege. Got our, our little party of lads. We've got our uh, our new warrior guy. I have this cool staff that, that I found. And uh, yeah, we've got a, a bit of gear for when our, our warrior strengthens up a little bit. I'm gonna check out some of the uh, use a bit more. Also, I discovered as uh, you might be able to see how to. Um... God damn it! I want the camera to always be focused on the guy in first. I discovered how to. Um... We're not much to offer after the Krug raid. Move my lads around. Who knows what them filthy creatures thought they'd find in poor old Eaton's roof. Go if you must, but remember, Eaton's roost is always open, rain or shine. So, in this town, there's like a couple of guys. I am Zed the Sorcerer, and as of late, Zed the Bard. I arrived, I am told, just in time to miss the biggest thing that's ever happened in this wretched village. If you can use a sorcerer, take me with you. I'd certainly like to see some excitement somewhere in this. You got free nature magic. I thought this was a combat I'm magic guy. Fortune for my services, but I'd be willing to take somewhat less just to get out of this putrid place. Okay, nine hundred. So there's a few people I can take here. Uh, I seem to remember. Obviously, we've got the friend of our old dead friend, uh, Gion. The raid last night was terrible. Barely escaped my life. Uh, when my sister hears about what the Krug did to us, she'll be furious. The word I was hurt. She's an archer in the Legion, stationed at Glacian. If you're going that way, could you tell her? She's not worried about me. See, this is a weird thing as well about like old games that doesn't happen anymore. Like, there's no accept or decline quest. It's just that has now been added to my journal as a thing I can just do. It's a sort of different idea than modern games. In modern games, it's like, you know... You think of how you play RPGs nowadays as, like... You go through the quests and you do each quest objective, whereas... Back in this time, it was more of a sort of, um... You know... Just here's a list of things you can do. Watch who you're kicking. I've got a sword and a mind to use it. And I would too if I didn't have this bloody hangover. People keep waking me up with some damn nonsense about saving the village. But you, uh, you look the sort that'll pay for my services. For a clink of gold, you'll have the. So I have 1,100. And uh, each of these people sort of getting close to that amount, basically, right? Um. The other person is a, um, I'm gonna take this guy. The other person is a, um, uh, is a archer. I'm not really that interested in archers, so. Resurrect, that's cool. Healing hands. <clears throat> so what I'm thinking is basically, because I'm not that interested in archers, I'm just gonna go full on with the, uh, Mages, and then some warriors. I think I talked to this thing time. Yeah, she just said. Um. Sister's message. Then I can't remember if I can actually like. Can we get a donkey? You can buy a pack mule. Me, we should have run the bastards out of these hills. When Could buy a pack mule. All those dung eaters like me were a pair of jacks and a half lame mare. The jacks I can part with for a price, though not for half as much as I could have a week ago. You interested? I don't know, man. I remember pet mules. I just. I also remember them being kind of awkward to deal with. I kept having to, you keep having to like run them away from fights and stuff. I don't feel like I. Uh... Need to grab too much. Um. 
This is where I'd want an actual map where I could like move around. Yes. The burnt house with some Krug stuff there. Hello, you. You got anything interesting to say? Okay. Is this just saying go to the tower? Go to the Northern God Tower, okay. Too much fuss and bother this talk about the Krug. True, they've made a mess of things, but <laughs> you need look no further than old fashioned. Is this? I think I was in here, yeah, I talked to the guy inside sell stuff. Thanks for coming by. Come back again soon. See, it's little things like this which are just like what makes these old games annoying to play, just dumb stuff like that. So, oh, that's actually the front gate, whoops. Or is it? No, north was the way that they, they asked to go. If you head north, you haven't seen anything but Krug come from that direction. Okay, so is that just play the path? Play the path. Okay. That's good. Oh, is this the well? Are you not attacking my? Holy! You think that's super good, right? It's like a regular old mace. Yeah, it's just a regular old mace, okay. <sighs> oh yeah, that was it. You're running past my guy, it's kind of annoying. Too far away to heal, like, don't do that. Here we go, this is where the game starts to sort of grow a bit, like it does, and it does, like I said last time, it is still sort of quite spammy, but um, because you have, we have now like a, oh.
Holy. Sometimes I just like... I think these things just don't do anything. And then, what was the button for just loot everything? I can't remember. Um... Is it Q? No, Q is drink potion. Oh, R. Oh, R, oh, that was it. R. Oh. I remembered. Realized sink as well. C and it's not C. I don't know why I'm obsessed with the idea that it must be C. You see as well, like imagine if you didn't have like the dedicated healer thing going on, like sort of made it up the uh, this cliff and this must be the guard tower they were talking about holy Everything here accurately is so he's just uh, like oh, he's got absolutely wrecked. These things like one hit any of my mages. Go, what are you doing? Kill her.
Oh, we're all on here. Oop. Oh. Into the darkness we go. Kyoto his axe. Another weird one, like it's like, get the axe. It doesn't say you have to like give it back to him or anything, it just says get the axe. And I'm like, okay, I've got the got the axe. Now what? And it's like, you did it. You've got the axe. some fishes in the bottom of the tower for some reason. Oh, I've accidentally done this now, so I click on each each separate one of them. Oh, maybe if I did this, it would, uh, Work better because he would be directly facing in. Let's try that. Quick save. Does the one that I select change who they focus? Why did you do it? You weren't even selected. See, like, as soon as you click on the ground, they just take that above, like, anything else you possibly tell them to do. It's really weird. Yeah, so four of these mana potions need to get stacked on this guy. Getting pretty low on potions here as well. And I believe that is the tower we're going to when we go like around in a big loop and come around. Which is nice sort of foreshadowing I guess. Maybe it's the other way around. Oh, it is that way. Oh, yeah, I remember this. So, the town of Glitterdelve and Glacian is over here, but the eastern tower is down there. You can see we can't get through here yet. Oh, shit. See, this is the sort of stuff that, like, every time I misclick, it's so bad because they always move. Like, if I, like, I've clicked attack there, but if I now click attack, uh, move there, and then click attack there again, she'll move up there. Oh, no, she doesn't. What? It's confusing, and now she's just 
instantly been killed. He curved. Why is that red? Holy shit. I mean, maybe I could give it to my man just so he can have a bow, I guess. I'm starting to have the feeling that, like, who you actually select affects who they go for a little bit. And you can't open it. The door seems to be locked. And then, get the quest. Open the door. Or attempt to open Great Veil Pass by way of the rest. So eventually my plan is going to be to have both of them just full spamming heals and then have preferably two people with combat magic just full deep DPSing. My idea at least. Oh, hello, this lad here. Okay, so basically he's saying the way you're about to basically what he's saying is the way you're about to go really sucks uh, and there's lots of spiders and it sucks he's getting wrecked so much with this I feel like I kind of want I kind of want two people, like two healers anyway, for this sort of stuff, but that seems ridiculous to have half my party be healers, and then I only have one DPS. Might end up being better, because at least then I use less potions. The things like this where they just do high damage, like I'm pretty sure they're meant to have you sort of do this. I can run around him. So that you dodge it, but I can't be bothered. If I can do this for free, it's fine. I guess it's not for free because it costs mana potions. Whatever. Here we go. <coughs> Into the Western Cross. So we've left. We've left this town. Uh, we uh, we got sent on a on a missive to get this this guy go to this guy because he'd know what to do from our old dying friend. This guy Gwen has said his name Gwen is something like that. Gion, and he said, "Yo, we need to go to Glacial, whatever it's called, to warn everyone." And now, once again, <laughs> I remember. I think in all games this used to be a, a sort of trope, but once again we are having to go the dangerous route because the uh, the straightforward route is blocked. 